It's the Cool Kids Toy Club! Time for some fun! Hey Cool Kids! Welcome back to the Cool Kids Toy Club! It's Cool Jay here and hang out with me is our cheeky cheeky monkey! And to keep up with our Christmas gingerbread theme, today we have a Disney Frozen Gingerbread Castle! Check it out! Awesome! Look, we've got a whole lovely tail right there. How cute is this? Oh my goodness, I am so excited. This is gonna be so much fun. Okay, let's see what's included in this really cool box here. Okay, so this kit includes a pre-baked gingerbread, pre-made icing, mini candy beads, and seam setters. Huh, look how cute this box is. And it says, look, and one Olaf cookie. <laughs> Yay! Oh, and look, Disney Frozen gingerbread kit. We've got Anna, we've got Elsa. We've got Anna and Elsa just hanging out. And look, we even have Kristoff and Sven. Oh, how cute. Oh, look, right here it says it's a peanut-free product. For all you kids who are allergic to peanuts, this is a product for you. This is great. And let's see what's on the other side. Oh, wait, on the side here it says gingerbread kit. And it's got another picture of Olaf, which I'm so excited to see inside. And right here on the back, it actually has here all the instructions. So everything we need is included here. We've got all the gingerbread pieces, we've got the icing, and it teaches you quickly how to assemble the gingerbread kit. And look, we also have these really cool scene setters. Look, we've got Anna and Elsa, we've got Kristoff and Sven, and all we're gonna have to do is just cut around the dotted lines. And what's this? Oh, we've got a glass roof. Awesome! I can't wait. And it does, does say here to have an adult help you in case, just with the just to cut around the dotted lines. So you know what we'll do. So we'll do that part last, but in the meantime, what we'll do is I'm just gonna open up to see what's inside. So inside this kit, we're just gonna open it up. We have a bag of icing. Oh no! Oh no! Look, it looks like our gingerbread is broken! No! Uh huh! And Olaf is broken too! Oh no! But you know what? We can definitely fix this. I'm not worried at all. So we've got all of our gingerbread pieces here. We've got some beaded candy for decorating. We've got our bag of icing. So let's open it up. castle pieces, but that's okay. That's something we can definitely fix. I'll show you cool kids how to do that in a minute, okay? So we've got our two pieces for the castle. We've got our two pieces for the wall. And look, we're poor Olaf. <laughs> oh no! Oh look, he's broken in half. Look, Olaf's head fell off. But you know what? I can tell this is gonna be something we can definitely fix as well. Okay, so we'll put Olaf aside. We'll fix him in a minute. And so according to the instructions, what we have to do first, again, just like all the other gingerbread houses, we need to knead the icing. So let's start kneading. Okay, cool kids, we've been kneading this icing now for about two minutes. You wanna knead it until you can feel that it's all nice and smooth and consistent on the inside, right? So just keep kneading until you feel it's right. I feel it's getting pretty close. So what we're gonna do first is I'm gonna kinda push everything down to the one side so that, you know, 
put all the icing. We don't want to lose any icing. Right, and then what you do is you have to cut a tiny little corner. So just make sure you don't cut the hole too big. Just a little hole. Did I even cut a hole? <laughs> okay, don't cut them too small, like I just did. There we go. Cut a little hole, and then you see here, you see the icy kind of poking through? That's what you want. So because we have, you see here, because we have the broken piece, what I wanna do is I just wanna put a little bit of icing on the broken piece here. See that? And I'm gonna try to kind of basically glue it together with the icing. So we're gonna take this piece, we're gonna get this piece of the wall, and we're just gonna squish it together like that. You see that? You want the icing to push out like that, so that means it's getting nice and tight. Make sure you get all of the corners, push it really hard, and we're gonna hold it here for about a minute, just to make sure it doesn't fall apart on us. Okay, so we're gonna just, you know what, we'll let that dry a little bit, put that down, and I'm gonna do the same thing with Olaf, right? We've got two pieces here, poor little guy. <laughs> and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a little icing again, right here, right by his little neck, right by his little chin. Poor little Olaf, I feel so bad. We're gonna take his little body and we're gonna just squish it together just like this. So we can have one piece. Oh, he is really cute though, even though his head fell off. <laughs> Hold it together. Again, hold it together for about a minute. Let it kind of dry a little bit. And then we'll decorate him last. He's so cute. Look at his little face. Oh, I love him. You know what, Cool Kids? Tell me in the comments below which is your favorite Frozen character. I'm a really big fan of Olaf. I think he's so adorable and he's so sweet. And he's kind of goofy like, like me. <laughs> Do you think he heard me? <laughs> oh, hi, Cheeky! <laughs> Just talking about Olaf. <laughs> okay, so let's put him down here and let him dry. And what we're gonna do next is make sure this piece is okay. Oh, look, it's pretty good. Nice and solid. Yay, we fixed it! We fixed our broken castle! Yay! So now what we're gonna do is, according to the instructions, we're gonna put these two together. So, we're gonna take the back of these two pieces, let's lay it down, and we're gonna put a little bit of icing on both sides so we can put the wall up. See that here? So put some icing here. Some icing here. Take the other piece. We're gonna put some icing here. We're gonna put some icing here. And be generous with the icing that you put on these sides because again, it's gonna be like a glue and we're gonna hold the castle together. Take these pieces and we're gonna basically make our little wall. So we'll put one piece here. See that? We're gonna pick our other piece here it all together, perfect. And then we're gonna take our last piece here and just see if I can flip this around without anything moving too much on us. Oh no! It's not what you wanna do. <laughs> okay, we're gonna put, keep the piece right here. Keep this piece right here. We're gonna place this piece right here. See that? Okay, we're gonna get it right inside. And make sure this doesn't fall off again, oh no. We're gonna kinda hold it nice and firm. See that, cute kids? You'd think I'd get better at this by now. <laughs> so we're gonna let this kinda stand right there. We're gonna let it harden a little bit. It's gonna take a little minute. It's gonna take a few minutes, I think. Don't move it around the way I have. Okay, so put it together, let it stand.
And I'll leave that right there for now. And do you think we might need a little more icing on this piece? I think we might. Let's just see. Oh, yeah, we definitely do. So we're just gonna fix this piece again. That's so risky, you know what, cool kids? That's a risk you take when you get a gingerbread kit, right? Sometimes the pieces might come broken, but you know what, we're gonna fix it. We're gonna make a beautiful castle, and it's gonna be perfect, see? Just like that. Awesome. So while that's gonna harden, and we're gonna have Olaf here as well, and he's doing pretty good. We're gonna leave this here just to set a little bit. We want the icing to get a little bit hard and it'll hold the, the castle together really nicely. So that's the first step to our Disney Frozen Castle. And again, we'll look here and it says very clearly right here, they want us to cut these character scene setters out. We want the roof and we want this. So we're gonna just get cutting, okay? are so perfect it's well worth the cutting around all of them right we'll put them right next to Elsa and Anna and look we also cut out this really cute glass roof now it says here we've got to fold it right along this line let's do that fold 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 and what we end up doing is we have a glass roof for our gingerbread house check it out so let's take a look at our house and see how it's looking. Wow, look at that. Let's see if it's set yet. So cute. Even with that piece like that, it's pretty adorable. Let's turn it around real quick. Oh no! Okay, it's definitely not set yet. So let's give it a couple more minutes and let it set. Okay, cool kids. So everything is setting, right? And so what we're gonna do next is we're gonna put on this glass roof. And how we're gonna do that is we're actually gonna put a little bit of icing. We put some icing along this edge here. We're gonna put one on the other side. And then we're gonna place the roof right on top. It's a little trickier than it looks. There we go. Right on top, just like that. Perfect. Leave that right in here. How cool is that? Now you've got this really nice glass roof. Look, it's so shiny. And look at that, now we have our glass roof. How beautiful. So what do you think we should do next? I think we need to start to decorate the outside of this beautiful Disney Frozen Castle. Check it out, it's got these beautiful lines already. So maybe what we should do is we should just follow it. What do you think?
Disney Frozen Gingerbread House. It's all done, it's all decorated. We've got Anna, we've got Elsa hanging out with us. We've even got Olaf and Sven and Kristoff. How perfect. And so what else are we missing? What do you think? So tell us in the comments below, which was your favorite part? Was it the icing? Was it the gingerbread house? Was it all of the little candies to decorate with? Was it Olaf? <laughs> was it these little cutout characters? Or is it dun 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 surprise? Look what we found! We found frozen surprise eggs! Yay! And look, I have one and two to open. Oh my goodness, this is so awesome. I thought we were just gonna be doing a gingerbread frozen house today, but nope. We have a couple of surprise eggs to open. Okay, let's see who's inside, who can come and hang out at the gingerbread house, okay? Perfect. Oh, these are kind of hard to open. Oh, here we go. What's inside? Oh, look, we have an Anna. Oh, look how cute she looks. And look, she's all ready. She comes with this really cute stand. We put her feet inside. Oh. Let's make sure we do it properly. Push your feet right in. Oh, there we go. Oh, she's so cute. Adorable. And look, she's got her little gloves on. She's got her beautiful cape. And look, if you look closely, she's even got flowers on her dress. Oh, I love her. She's so pretty. Okay, let's put her right next to the Disney Frozen Gingerbread House. Hello, everybody. Hello. And we have one more egg to open. Oh, who do we have? Look at that! Oh, look, he looks so handsome. He's got his beautiful glove out, and look, he looks like he's ready to ask you to dance. <laughs> okay, and he also comes with this little stand. We'll put him right here. And look, he's gonna come over here to the gingerbread castle, and he's gonna ask Anna to dance. Hello, Anna. Hello, Hans. Would you like to dance? Why, certainly. La la la, la la la, la la la, la la la, la la Ah, beautiful. Thanks so much for hanging out with us today, cool kids. Hope you enjoyed building this awesome Disney Frozen gingerbread house as much as we did. And again, this kit comes with a gingerbread house, a gingerbread Olaf, and a couple of cutouts. Look, there's Kristoff, there's Sven, and there's Anna and Elsa. And today, in a couple of our little surprise eggs, we were able to open up Anna and Hans, so they can join the party as well. Awesome! All right, cool kids. Now, don't forget to subscribe and leave us any comments below letting us know which was your favorite part of this whole Disney Frozen gingerbread house. Thanks again for hanging out with us. We'll see you again soon. Bye! Thanks for hanging with me today, cool kids. And keep a lookout for our next video. You'd never know what we're up to next. Don't forget to subscribe, cool kids.